Hello everyone, and welcome back to Shadowrun Dragonfall. We are back from our mission at the Humanus Paula Club after taking it all of the way down. We've got several things to turn in here, so we should expect a good payday. We've got lots of karma to spend, we should hopefully have a lot of money to spend. So let's take care of that before we move on to our many other pressing objectives. First off, let's talk to Samuel Beckenbauer. Hello again, mein Freunden. What can I do for you? Uh, I'm covering what Humana is up to. You find the details on this data pad. Beckenbauer eyes the plans on the data pad, then nods, then nods grimly. This fits with Humanus's established pattern of behavior. Horrific and vile. According to this data pad, Humanus compounds all over Berlin have received similar shipments. They are planning to deploy the gas tomorrow morning. He exhales sharply, then nods again. I have a feeling that the Flux State will have a thing or two to say about that. Stahl has overstepped his bounds. His hubris will be his undoing. You mark my w Ooh, sorry, excuse me. You mark my words. Within the next few hours, the Humanist Polar Club is going to take a hammering that will make the Knight of Rage look like a peace rally. I owe you a great deal, Shadow. We all do. I will wire your payment to the account number that Amsel provided. Pleasure doing business with you. Anything else you want to talk about? Do you actually need any donations right now? The new library is marvelous, Shadow. You have worked miracles for this organization. Our next goal is to purchase a set of trode nets for our new work training program. I have high hopes for this plan, Shadow. With these devices, we could teach job skills to the least educated members of our society in a fraction of the time that it would take for them to learn on their own. With 400 new yen, we could make the purchase. We could make the purchase. Whatever you could spare would be most appreciated. Yeah, take what you need. I got you covered. Samuel's eyes widen. This is incredibly generous. Thank you, Meinfrunden. Not a big deal, Sam. Do good with it. I can scarcely believe it. With this donation, we have met our penultimate goal. Ooh, one more. I will send a volunteer to the Data Haven, Haven to acquire the Trode Nets. In the meantime, I will make the happy announcement to our guests. Thank you again, Shadow. You will never know how important you've been to the people I serve. It's my pleasure, Samuel. Anything to help. Cool. Silky's doing great. Okay, nothing new. All right, let's talk to Lane. Hello, Lane. Even from a distance, it is clear something is not right with Lane. Coming closer, you can see dried blood on his face and clothes, as well as a few discolored blotches that pass for bruises on troll skin. More noticeably, there is considerable damage to the man's left prosthetic leg, which he now tends to with tools as antiquated as the leg itself. Are you all right, Alexei? I'm fine. Nothing a few swings of a wrench can't fix. Or a few swings of a crutch. Someone comes at me, thinks me weak, and I show him otherwise. Leaning to one side, Lane's crutch is caked in more blood and what appears to be bits of hair. Tell me who did this to you. I'm just a punk with some bad ideas. Forget about it. Are you sure you're alright? I've suffered far worse, as you might imagine. And I don't need you or anyone else baby. Okay. Anything new if I talk to you again? No, okay. Well, hope you're okay, my guy. Let's go drop the uh, phone booth pay dirt, and then we'll go talk to Lane and get his money. Anything new with you, Simmy? Simmy Kim weaves an awkward dance through scattered refuse. Her two thin legs wobble, but she keeps her footing throughout. The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be sun. We could all use a little sun down here. It's not literal sun, silly. It means tomorrow will be a better day. Monica used to say something like that. When I was tired, when I was sad, when I only wanted to sleep, she would tell me that. She told me I would forget. That the pain would go away. I've lived many lives, but I've been an orphan more times than anything. 
It was the first story I found when I needed to get away. Anyone ever tried to get you off The Sims? But I need them. Monica understood that. And Zack says they're safe. I don't know what I'd do without them. Without them, I dream. And I don't want to dream. I don't want to remember. They help me forget. They help me be strong and smart. And I never lose anyone. And that makes it a good thing, right? Maybe someday you won't need them. Maybe. So do you like it here in the cruise, bosser? Kim turns her head so as not to look you in the eyes. Her posture is that of someone who fears the possible repercussions of her answer. It's good. I can get what I need from Zack Flash or Doc Ezkabel, and they let me pay however I can- Oh. Mm. Monica was always nice, and Paul Amsel, and the Angel is nice to me too, usually. I know Monica's gone now, but I can stay, right? Of course you can stay, Kim. Thank you! Oh, thank you, I don't know what else I would do. I'm not gonna kick you out of here. This is your home, for better or for worse. All I can do is try and make your life a little bit better or make the environment that you call home a little bit better. That's all anyone can really do. Machine accepts the... D <clears throat> Ooh, sorry. Mm, extra for me today. Machine accepts the data upload and only a few moments later a certified crit stick is spat out of the coin slot. I got a karma point and uh, 500 new yen. That's, that's not bad. That brings us up to 10 karma. I think, um, what's her face has some new lines? Lucky Strike? I think she has lines that change as you go. Haven't we met? Oh, did I accidentally skip this last time? Okay. Lost your friend. Did you know her? your prerogative, but then you didn't really know her. Well, I got a lot of people. She was our team leader, of course we listened to her. It's a slightly different uh, line than last time. Yeah, I can change my opinion, blah, blah, blah. Cool. Now, do you have any new lines? Because we... No? Okay. We'll uh, continue to check in. Things might change, but I'm not sure if that's if that's just kind of all with Lucky Strike. Um, okay, lane. Oh, what's... Pointing to... Oh, U-Bon? I think it's pointing to the U-Bon. You're the sewer guy, right? You're gonna go back? Oh, no, you're my weapons guy. I'll talk to you in a minute. I think he might have idly threatened me there, but that's fine. He seems to be a very... hard man that likes to... You could say joke, but also bluster a bit more than what he needs to. I can't tell if this is new or old dialogue. Like, I feel like some stuff is... didn't get saved. No, okay, these are new lines and I'm skipping past them. I'm sorry. Um, I never really went to school. Pretty much been a street kid as long as I can remember. And there was so much to learn from people outside of school that I never really bothered. It makes it difficult to get a job. So all us good street kids do. So as all, I chose a place to haunt with my friends and always hung out there. That was all Tuke's cafe and he was super nice about me and mine. I felt more comfortable with him than I did mine Vat. Her dad maybe? Her eyes narrow only for the briefest moment of the word. And we talked a lot when I was waiting around for my friends. He must have been fairly comfortable with me too, otherwise he wouldn't have offered me a job. What is it that you do, really? 
I much prefer his hookah options, though. Real coffee makes me feel paranoid. Speaking of which, I should probably get back to work. See you around. Yeah, sorry, I, I, I know I skipped some lines there. I think uh, the whole thing with Lucky Strike had me feeling that a lot of it would be repeated somehow. Anyways, I'll be more careful. Welcome back, runner. Humanist leader is safe. Hope that pays off. It does. For you. Here's your pay. I hope they torture him good. Got anything new for me, Altuk? I am told you have been quite busy of late, oh wanderer of the shadows. Hey, that's my name. My street rats tell me that business is picking up. Is that the woman who was taken over for Monica Burakazi? Who does it look like, your rotundity? The Pope from the Vatican? Give her a soy calf, a big one, and put it on my account. I like the cut of her jib. A large soy calf, my you are the generous one, Goldschmidt. Are you sure you can afford such a gesture? Fat man frowns. Man a scone, I was going to say, and a scone as well. Nothing is too good for her. As you desire, oh ample one, the Turk whispers. The man is a moron, but he eats his weight in baklava and pastries, so who am I to care? Now what is it you would like? Better to have another real coffee on hand, just in case. What do we have in terms of items? Good. I've got a Turkish coffee in case I need to bribe anybody. Somehow it stays warm, don't question it, <laughs> but uh, when society lives on soy calves and you have a real coffee bean coffee, oh that's going to be the perfect thing to bribe many people with. Especially if it costs ten times as much as a soy calf does. Got that drone fixed yet? I do! I just finished before you arrived. There's a complication, though. What is it? <clears throat> this drone's got a custom AIOS stack on it. Someone wrote code that sits on the boat bootloader and configures the drone to only accept commands from a specific user. The thing works like a computer virus, so there's no way I can rip it out unless I got another brain from this model of drone. Before you ask, yes, I looked into that. Problem is, this is a stolen corp drone. A discontinued model of a stolen corp drone. And there are no parts for this thing on the market around here. So unless you know who locked this thing up so tightly, you're not going to get more of use out of it than a doorstop. Drek. Well, I'll ask around for its owner. Thanks. And then, just the regular stuff, okay. Um, so we've got our payment. Somehow we're only up to 2183. Yeah. Alright. Well, let's spend our karma really quick. Um, my decking need to go up. Is that maximum for trolls? No, okay, it's fine as it is. Level 5 decking. Um, charisma up at all? It's fine for now. Uh, I think I needed to focus on my actual combat skills here. Yeah, 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 because I wanted Overwatch. Definitely taking that, and... Can we up our rifle? We might as well up our rifle. And that leaves us with two. Let's maybe take a point in dodge just uh, to help us out a little bit. I'd like to be able to see enemy HP, so I'll get that up a little bit more. Cool. I don't think there's anything new we need decking-wise, but we'll take a peek. Cool. We could buy the next deck, but I mean, we've got this one. We'll leave that be for now. Uh, we do have some upgraded uh, programs, though. Okay, what do I have? I've got Blaster, Erosion, Killer, Medic, and Shield. So, Erosion, Blaster, Medic, Huh, there wasn't a killer. Was there? Oh, there was. K 
regular... Shield's not really worth it because it takes a whole turn to set up. And... Can I afford to maybe get... A new ESP? Just for more allies, you know? I'll get a shield ESP. That feels worth it. Now, how much money does that leave me? 883. I basically just spent everything I have. I mean, that's fine. We've got decent guns. We have some uh, health kits, but I would like to upgrade them if we can. Alright, so Amsel's here with big mission stuff, but I still have another side quest to do first. So let's do that, then we'll link up with, with Paul. Alright, assemble the team and travel to the pharma laboratory complex to eliminate the loose ends from your client's botched run. We will take our team, of course. Sorry Blitz, I'm basically never going to use you, and sorry to all of you guys, I'm never going to use you either. I, I have a dedicated team that upgrades as we go, why would I ever do anything different? Come on. You can do a game. You can do it! There you go. Loose ends. Your client has hired you to tie up loose ends at a site of a botched cloak and dagger operation. One of the operatives from the failed mission has been captured by knight errant security forces, and it's only a matter of time before he talks. Your job is simple. Kick in the door, find the operative, and put a bullet in his guts before he can spill them. I mean, can't I just bust him out? You know, like... I can deliver him to them and you can do whatever you want with him, but maybe he can just... Yeah, why not just bust him out? Like, honestly. I'm gonna try that if, if it'll let me. Oh, okay, so... I'm gonna take you out and put... You in. Good. Okay. The reception area of the Sharing Pharma AG Lab looks normal enough. The synth leather couches were obviously designed more for appearance than for comfort, and the blue steel walls are gently illuminated with energy efficient recessed lighting. All in all, it's a perfect example of typical corporate design sensibilities. Bland, generic, and safe. An overturned houseplant is the only sign that something might be amiss in the lab ahead. You ready for this, boss? According to what Herr Fuchs told us, this entire complex is going to be crawling with hired security. It's going to be a hell of a fight. Oh my god, that was bad. British first hand of fight, let's do it. Couldn't care less about a fight, I just want the paycheck. We can handle it. Get ready, people. We can handle it, I'm pretty confident. We're all here, right? Oh yeah, Iger's frame is just kind of blocking uh, glories. Alright, why don't you open the door and see what we're dealing with. Yeah. Here, uh, why don't you give her a haste? <clears throat> so she can get herself to a proper bit of cover. Well, as best as we can get here. Nice. That's exactly what I want to see. Alright, rush him. That's fine. At least you're putting pressure on. Drag them back! Intruders! Yeah, too close range for the sniper. Looks like we're going to be able to deck in. That's good. a knife here. Ah, 
Ah, uh, shame that wasn't a kill. Hello, hello, hello. Let's get in there. Yeah, go harass this one. Nice. Put over here and do that. Which should do AP damage, I think it said. Hmm. No, I can't look, that's unfortunate. So I should be able to go away with that. Almost. Oh yeah, you have one HP still. Ow. Get a medic on her. Alright, let's get our crew. And still have one AP left. Let's go ahead and do blaster. Yeah. I like how the music in here is totally like much more calm and chill. Nice. Damn, makes sense. You are a defensive one. Can you finish the job though? Nice. Alright, Assassin, you go ahead and scout a little bit. What was that? Something just activate? Or is it just that I can see that? I think it's just that I can see that. Okay. Just got a little bit more. Oh, oh, there we go. That's what I knew was coming. We'll flank him. Ah, dang it. Yeah, they've got, like, no health. I need to get some upgraded versions of them. Yeah. Okay, well that's that one taken care of at least. Can we get an erosion on this one? Ah, big rip. Hopefully we're okay to leave uh, our character here. Can I really not? Oh, pain. Fine. Yeah, hopefully nobody comes in from this way. So let's get a medic on you. That should bring you back to full, which is nice. <laughs> You're just wounded three. Not a huge deal. Oh, hello. I can't re-summon you, right? No, oh, yeah. Come on, me! You can hit better than that. I guess no flank. We're gonna link up. That way a shield bot can at least do some shielding for me. Although it's currently drawing aggro, so I'm I'm not complaining about that. There we go. Nice, got the erosion off. Did I? No, I just did a regular attack. Do the erosion this time. There we go. Should die on its turn. gonna send of course there's more defenses we 
Was this the only path, by the way? I think it was, yes. Okay, so this node only connected the security cameras. Damn, I was hoping I would get this one, too. Shield is still on cooldown, so at the very least, let's have you continue to fulfill aggro duty. What are you doing? Oh, it's charging an attack. That's not great. Um, let's go ahead and give Iger a haste. Yeah, that was an odd decision. I don't know why I did that. Hello. Oh, that's not super great. Ow. What's your health? Um, I should actually heal the shield. I don't want it dying as my only other ally. sure what you were charging but you're dead now can you access that for me please cool we now have the cameras and I think we're good to just get the hell out of here I don't have to worry about bringing the, um, the shield bot back when I jack out it will uh, join me I think the assassin might even replenish but that might be it for it Hello, I'm back. I've killed your inferno. Bleed for me. Plus one AP damage. Reduces HP. I'm not seeing that doing AP damage, but I mean, that's fine. Pinning hit. Oh yeah, sure. Aw. Iger, come on. That's more like it. We good? I think we're good for the moment. Okay, so we have the cameras. Let's actually take a look now. enemies in there it looks like I think I didn't open that door yet I should be able to kind of move around not this way because I don't have any drones with me oh hello oh my I see okay well, I should be able to go around and at least engage him over here or over here. So let's do that. Hey, uh, why don't you go patch D a trick up? Body on the table looks like the gender. His chest and stomach appear to have been brutally torn open. Ooh, disturbing. Alright, everybody in position. Just in case. 
Nope, we're good to push. Everybody push. Give haste to me. We'll go gather up that loot. I'll let you guys kick this door in. Oh, neat. Let me take a first aid kit. Ah, kamikaze. That'll be good to sell later. How are you still wounded for six? I have hit you with a first aid. Oh, that was that ongoing damage, I think, and he was just continuing to take it. Oh, that's not who I wanted to send backwards. should have triggered overwatch come on Iger what the hell yeah he can shoot you but you can't shoot him Un unbelievable unbelievable look at that he's standing right in front of you Iger that is so disappointing Wait a second. Does she does Iger have enough biotech that she can see health? Because if that's the case, I don't need the biotech on myself. I wonder if I can revert that. Almost always gonna have Iger with us. By the way, I, uh, I closed every other background process I could before doing this recording, so I'm really hoping you guys aren't dealing with, uh, lag for this episode. I will find out afterwards. Shit, look at that. What happened to him? Oh, line from glory. Ooh, do you mean that guy? Probably. Can't see what percent that is. Is it like 15? Ah, whatever. Get some damage. We'll take that. Noise. That was a headshot. Wow! Enough with these crits on me, do you trick? You wouldn't mind? Thanks. What does this do? Dragon Slayer's favor one concentrates mana from the surrounding area to provide an affair and effect similar to small game. Last a few rounds. What does a ley line do? Oh yeah, these are our ley lines, I believe. If you stand on them, you like heal or something? I don't know. Let's find out. Hopefully that wasn't an offensive one. Mana charge, eh? Interesting. I think that's 50%. 50-50 shot. Uh, two out of three ain't bad. So meatloaf does. Can you truly trust a man that calls himself a, a food?
We need back from the main hall now! Oh shit, hello. I'm assuming I can't go through that. I'm assuming it's because I took too long to kill them. Also, nice kill there. These guys are weak! Weak, I say. Oh, I broke his armor. How do you like that? Man, see if you can't get a heal off on her, damn. Yeah, that's fine. Can you get one more? That's better. Oh, did the, uh... These guys push up? No, they're still holding their position. Okay. Burn, baby, burn. Oh. Yeah, kind of deserve that for getting everyone clustered. Ooh, double flashbang. Well. How about screw you? Ha, I missed and you still got hit. Gotta reload your pistol. Nice. Oh, cool, they're letting us just move around without needing to, uh, do turns and stuff for at least a little bit. Okay, so let's go ahead and open that door, just because. Not allowed in there. Grizzly scene. Body on this operating table has been torn to pieces. The dual arms of an auto surgeon, something, something. Drek, what happened in there? Interesting. So here we've got an ambush. Can I direct everybody really quick? Like, can I make you go stand in certain places or whatever? No? Okay. Uh, how's everybody's health doing? I think we're doing mostly okay. Let's trigger this. Uh, I mean, I could have used the health. I was in perfect position. Ha! Ah, get out of here, drone. Nobody cares about you. Nice sniping. Keep them away from the elevator! No, now I want to go to the elevator. Glory seriously needs to uh, get some health over to us ASAP. 
think what we're gonna do, just to make sure she can get back into cover, is we're gonna haste Glory. And then have her run over a health kit and run back. Nice, good teamwork. Nice. Keep you up on the sniping. Excellent. Iger is definitely a better sniper than us at the moment, as pained as I am to say. But that's okay. Iger can't deck, and Iger also can't talk her way out of many situations, which is why she isn't team leader. Right, Iger? Shut up! Atta girl. Okay, I love it when I miss and still hit. Rip. Ow! Deatrick, my guy, are you okay? Oh, come on. Good. I wanted him dead, and then... Well, at least one of them hit. Okay, go ahead and heal I didn't click there, my guy. That's really annoying. Oh, I have another shot. I think Ley Lines and the whole mana charge thing uh, just reduces your cooldowns for your spells. That's acceptable. Didn't do any damage. Could have capitalized on the fact that I brought my guy out of cover, but no. Hey, I'm not complaining. Not in cover, but hopefully this will be a kill shot. Yeah, baby. That's what I like to see. We are still in combat, though, so everybody be aware. Oh, yeah, because there's turrets around here. I'm glad we never have to worry about running out of ammo. Like, you have to reload, yes, but you always have more. Have her go open that door. That's fine. Oh. Create a remote control link to the turrets. Ugh. That's unfortunate. Kind of tempting to get into rigging, specifically as a as an interaction with decking. That's fine. We got a free easy kill on the turrets. We take that. It's not like we get XP per enemy kill or anything. I'm surprised Luca hasn't contacted us. Well, this looks pleasant. Pile of corpses, bodies are all dressed in high quality ballistic armor. Too late, they're here! Fast response team inbound! Hold until the reinforcements arrive! Optional lockout the night errant reinforcements. 
Uh, looks like I'm gonna need to do some decking for that. Over here, okay. Beatrix, haste please. I bet if we open the containment cells, that'll mess them up. I mean, we'll still have to deal with them. But distractions are always good. Next turn, I guess, unfortunately. I should have had her click on that instead of moving to the thing, because then she would have actually done it on the turn. Can I... I hate that there's no undo button, you know? Sometimes misclicks do happen. Oh, hello. I should have Deatrick do that more often. I don't take advantage of, the, of summons enough. Open the basilisk, basilisk cells. This should be interesting. All AP lost, yeah. They can be dangerous. Did opening that use up an entire turn or something? Can I if I if I restart this level, will it restart this floor or the entire thing? Because if it's just going to restart this floor, that's perfect. So I'm kinda mad about it. Very inefficiently used. Yeah, that's fine. This is the for the whole mission. Let's see if it starts me from the lobby or from the elevator. I'm really hoping it's the latter. Ugh. Rip. No. That's fine. That's how it be. Not everything goes to plan. Okay, back to the scenario. Yeah, let's definitely try and get that grand gear down if we can. That's fine. You trick, let's, sort of, let's go ahead and get you behind some cover, and then we're gonna have you maybe do a summoning yourself. Just why not? You replenish them anyway. like to kill that Grenadier before he does any Grenadier. If possible. Pay data node. I like those. Security reinforced door. Okay, so I have to kill this squad as quickly as humanly possible, but it probably won't be quick enough. Which is fine. We can always tear through more night errands. Yes, hi, can you do a shield, please? Seriously, you don't want to do it on other programs, just me or yourself? Well, that's not as good. I should get um, an attacker program because they have more health, but still have uh, some decent kill abilities. Assassinate do 150 damage. So we're not gonna hit. Oh, cool. That's exactly what we needed to do.
can only really take one hit before it goes down, though. Whereas at least a shield one can take a few. Nice. White Sparky, I see. Ugh. That's rude. I think this is our last turn before we go back to meet space combat. select your other programs that was weird uh, game are you doing okay Don't glitch out on me. What is going on with this area? Oh my god, the assassin fixed it. Thank you, assassin. Beautiful program, you. Ugh, if I had one more turn in here, I could totally block him out. The Inferno's control got broken and then it got the hell out of here. Ooh! Looks like I'm gonna get my chance. Do it! Aha! Alright, so I came from that way. There's also pay data over here. So optional, of course, but why wouldn't I go for it? take a bit for our programs to catch up, so we're kind of on our own for, a, for the moment. Ooh, yeah. If you get an erosion on that, that would be ideal. You could not. Ah, uh, it's unfortunate. Ow. Ooh, perfectly set up for blaster. Nice. And this should kill one of them, and this should get the other almost dead. Shield, hurry up and catch up! And I cannot summon, or er, unsummon and then resummon. Because once you've used them, you've used them. Although I think if I were to... Yeah, this is the second area I hacked. So they did replenish, because remember, he died. So once you, like, jack out safely, you kind of get everything refreshed, so to speak. Which makes total sense. Right, can we land this this time? Thank you. Nice. And I was kind of counting on assassin program to kill this one. Shield is here. Oh, come on. I was counting on you. You got shield hurt. Killed even. Well, no. I think he still has a bit more health. That's fine. So our only friends are the ones that are in this room. Let's get 
to maybe a bit better cover. Still 70% chance. I guess they're so big that it's like hard not to hit them. So I'm just gonna finish you off. Look at us. Yeah, good. By the way, I'm gonna have to start hitting the the basilisk soon here too. Here, shield. You finish this one off. Then. Oh my god, are you guys kidding me? Are you really gonna make me do it myself? Good. Yes, there. Thank you. And let's get that pay data. Chemical research data. Yeah, thanks. I'll make a profit. And we're good to get the heck out of here. Rejoin our team in meat space. You guys don't matter. Just chill. Ooh, the captain. Hello, captain. You look like you could use a friend to play with. Here. We'll wound the other one. Safety right there. Go ahead and huck a phosphorus over here. You're probably gonna miss. Oh, you've got it. 27%. You got it. Good for you, Iger. Him out. Sap him again. You love to see it. True miss. Go full auto with you. 21 damage, not bad. I could use a fetish, but I mean, we're probably fine. Force three air. I've only used the Earth one so far, so let's maybe use the air. Hello, here I am, right in the open. Hopefully those three all play with each other nicely. I could kill that one, but I want to do a little bit more damage. Yeah, all right, maybe switch to your shotgun now. Except for him, he's in perfect sniping range. Oh, kind of him now. All right, switch to your sniper. Oh, did the basilisk die? Oh, it did. I see. I have you do as much as you can over here. Just three quickness. on this one then. He's our last enemy. Hey, nice. Hit both. There's like a 30% chance. 
here, Iger. Eighty-one percent, not bad. Hit once more, please. Thank you. From the description that your client gave you, this must be your target. The Rigger Thorvald Enstad. You can see him waving and pounding on the plastic of his cell door, but from where you're standing, the scene is eerily silent. He looks like he's had a rough go of things. One of his eyes has been blackened, and his lower lip is split wide open. Not particularly surprising given the temperament of his captors. The only incongruous element in it is his outfit. He's decked out head to toe in patched black riding leathers. A pair of oversized studded combat boots shine in the halogen glare of the cell's lighting panels. From his style of dress, it's obvious that this dwarf is not a corporate employee, he's a shadow runner. This isn't some corporate boot goon, boss. Look at him! He's one of us! Glory shudders but holds her silence. Deatrick lays a hand on the bare metal of Glory's shoulder. She flinches but only barely. When he speaks, his voice is soft. There but for the grace of God, eh, love? Glory's eyes remain fixed on the rigger, who continues to hammer impotently on the door of his cell. Something like that. And now I have to figure out what to do with him. Our client, of course, wants us to kill him. But if we can get him out of here, I don't see why not. Hi, Thorvald. The door slides open and the stench of stale sweat assaults your nostrils. Enstad steps forward, his bloody lips curled into a smile. The soles of his boots squeak on the polished tile floor. Free at last! Thank Christ! His smile widens into a sickly grin. Tar-stained teeth shine wetly in the lights. Didn't think I'd warned a rescue! Whoever sent you, thank him for me! Afraid you're wrong about that. I was sent here to tie up loose ends, namely you. I'm gonna give you the chance. His eyes go wide. He raises his trembling hands in surrender. Whoa there, Chief! I I don't know what your client told you. Said that your team botched a run, went loud too early, and got a lot of people killed. Us! We botched the run! That's bullshit, man! We did everything like we were supposed to, like always. It was that bastard's bad intel that got us hung out to dry. Sounds familiar. Please, hear me out. I promise, I'll make it worth your while if you do. Glory shrugs. Couldn't hurt to hear what he has to say. His hands clasp in front of him in a sign of supplication. You can see the terror in his eyes. Go ahead, talk. All right, okay. So we go in, right? Me and my team, and we're doing just what the client told us to. Well, the bastard forgot to mention that Pharma had a night errant security contract for the place. He told us that there would be little, if any, resistance. So imagine our surprise when a KE response team kicked in the door and unloaded on us. Shoot. We need the etiquettes, man! According to the client, the reason why Knight Errant showed up was because your team started slaughtering the lab staff. Everyone goes sideways at some point. You should have been prepared for it. Lab staff. That's bullshit! They attacked us! And the Knight Errant showed up and everything went to hell! <clears throat> Look, I can see that you're skeptical. I get that! Can't blame you for it either. You don't know me for math. But I know one thing that you will understand. I'd like to offer you a trade. I've got a little toy hidden away. Managed to stash it before those knight errant pukes took me. My own design, totally one of a kind. I call it a pain inducer. Great A fun for the runner who has everything. And I guarantee that you'll never find another. Yeah, that's not helping your case as to you not firing first, that you have a weapon called the pain inducer. You let me live, and it's all yours! I'll put a fucking ribbon on it for you! Then I'll disappear! Never bother any of you again, Scout's Honor! Even if, even if, we'd consider going off mission, she shoots you a significant glance, which we wouldn't. She turns back to Enstad, staring him down. Did you honestly think that we'd sacrifice our professional integrity and a 15,000 new yen payday for a train? 15,000? It's probably 1,500. He nods slowly. 
Fifteen, huh? I, I can match that. You let me live and I'll pay your wage. Plus the inducer. Hell, you can even tell your client I'm dead and bill him too. Double your earnings. What do you think about that? How'd you come by the fifteen grand? I had a payday a while back. Put the extra cash in my rainy day fund. Trust me, pal. I can pay you the money. You help me out and I'll transfer it to you myself. I just need to go back to the room where I stash my PDA. Nah. He's gonna lead us into a trap and try and kill us. Honestly, I know I was preaching all about letting this guy go, but he he's he's seeming pretty fishy, and I could absolutely see him betraying us. So, no, Iger's right. We came here knowing what we had to do. We can always take the weapon off his corpse. Well, he got a punch in. Good for him. Instad's lifeless body lies crumpled on the ground. His mouth is frozen open in a silent scream. Good call, Iger. Shadow. Iger nods at you. Nods. We all knew what we were here to do. Good on you for stepping up and doing it. Now, I can totally just take the weapon off his corpse, right? No? I guess I, he would have had to give it to us anyways. Yeah, I don't want your pain inducer. That, that just sounds unpleasant. So what, did we just go out the way we came? I guess so. I'm guessing we're going to have some, uh, resistance, though. Check the cameras. I no longer have cameras. That's interesting. I wonder if they locked me out. Still have that one. None of the others. Everybody catch up. Oh, hello. The leader of the group is an elf with Asian features. He's obviously a vat job. The bands of corded muscle that bulge out under his sleeves have a distinctly store brought thought look to him. I could have had uh, Enstad as an ally here. When he speaks, his voice comes out in a gravelly rumble. My, my. The intrepid shadow, with no rigor in sight. I must admit, I am impressed. Yeah, well that makes two of us. Who the hell are you? Herr Fuchs sent us to check up on you. Given his recent trouble with shadow runners, this should not come as a surprise. Company man smiles and nods slightly. I shall return to him and report your task completed to my satisfaction. Good day. Oh! Oh, cool! I avoided a fight by doing my damn job! He'll love to see it. Okay. And they just, like, literally phased out of existence. Cool. Yep, we out. Professionalism, kiddos. Most of the time. Don't hesitate to betray your client if they are betraying you first. Your subway car is empty on the return trip to the crew as bosser. The stretch of the sprawling U-Bahn tunnel system doesn't see much use, it seems. At least not at this hour. As the train rattles on, you find yourself lost in thought. Old memories creep, unbidden, to the forefront of your mind. Memories of Monica in the old days, and the crew that you used to run with. Memories of success and failure, of wealth and poverty, of good times and bad. Halfway back to the crew as boss room, you are jolted out of your reverie by a buzzing sound. You're calmly. You're receiving a call. Well, that's... ominous. Your calm link buzzes. A quick glance at the screen tells you that Amsel is on the line. You pick up and his voice fills your ear. Mm, Shadow, I trust that I'm catching you at a good time. As good a time as any. What's up? I have made contact with another prospective client. A rather elusive woman of Aztlaner descent. She calls herself Frau Mueller. What's the job? She will not say. Not to me, at any rate. She has insisted that she will speak only with you. She wants to meet with you in a half hour's time, at a location of your choosing. What's she offering for this mystery job? 36,000 new yen. Quite an impressive sum, Shadow. I would not have bothered you with this otherwise. That's a lot of money. Alright, count me in. Very good. I will instruct her to come to the cruise bar, sir. Where would you like to meet? Uh, 
a statue in the park. It's public, but secluded enough to discuss business in. No need for her to wander around. I'll meet her at the Bubon Station. Cafe says they... L2 is going to find out about this enemy. Might as well have this discussion in comfort. To the statue in the park. Noted. I will set up the meet. Shadow, there's one other thing. You should... Your comm link cuts to static. A moment later, the lights in the U-Bahn car flicker and wink out. We hear the screeching sound of steel on steel, and the train grinds to a halt. Well, this is... possibly bad. Looks like the whole station's lost power. We should try to find the fuse box. Oh my god, Deatrix. You poor man, your voice never stays consistent. Alright, well, sudden detour. Honestly, I think this is going to be a good spot to leave things off for today. Good bit of mystery, and we've been going long enough. So, thank you everyone for joining me. I hope you had fun. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you all next time for some more Shadowrun Dragonfall. Bye bye